Okay, so that was the program to bet. Yeah, it was good. It was, um, I think after a few minutes, it took me quite deep and I clicked out. And I was aware that the light was on and um, the, the white light, the, you know, the, the epsilon pulse. And then uh, I woke up again and I saw the typical uh, Pandora star, the blue light. Which was which was on, which is over my bed. So I have this suspended over my head as I sleep, and as I'm laying here. So it's a really good place to just have it there permanently for me to use. Um, so the program itself, um, it's, it's it, was, it felt quite therapeutic and relaxing. Um, first of all, I was thinking, oh, it's it's a light instantly because I literally like woke up about five a.m. And decided to put on Tibet, and because it's like an epsilon program and transcendental states of meditation, so the two hundred hertz lambda, I thought, okay, I'll just play around with the dream state and see what happens. And yeah, I had quite a lot of vivid um, dream state, um, which was kind of like reality checks as you get in like uh, lucid dreaming and outward experiences. And I used to have a, an ear tunnel in my ear and it fell out the other day and we been trying to find it it was just, it's this long um like horn i kept finding all these different types of horns in the dream and i only have one i get funny yellow ones and red ones and really thick ones and thin ones and i think oh i haven't seen that one before but not only that it was also at um my old place i used to live and i just i wasn't aware enough but i had a lot of vivid sort of um, dream activity as well, which was interesting. Um, yeah, it, it completely just detached me and disconnected, which was really nice. So, um, like any meditation practice or any, any Pandora star session that you get into, it's important not to judge anyone for the first time or anyone against another because we're like the weather, you know, we're filled up with different emotions and things can change and shift and nothing's ever the same. So it's important to um, just go in there with no expectations but have a goal. So I didn't film any separation from my body, I, um, but I felt like I was instantly relaxed and within a few minutes I think I must have clicked out, then I became conscious again with the light on, then I clicked out, and then I woke up with the blue light on again. So I turned that off, and what's good about the Pandora Star is that it sort of sustains you in these brainwave states. Um, you know, after you've after the program is finished, your your brain waves are synchronized there already. It's kind of like having an after effect of being on a program, and you are remained in that sort of. Um, the after effect of the brainwave states so um, yeah it's like the program Sleepy which I recorded um, although it's 20 minutes long it can sustain you all, all night you don't have to be under it constantly all the time so the same with Tibet you know you can put it on and then it can shut off itself and then uh, you remain in those brainwave frequencies for a lot longer so yeah very good um, it's still the morning, I'm going to get up now and enjoy the rest of the day. So I also feel quite energised too and my brain feels refreshed. I think that's the Lambda um, 200 hertz in the Tibet program. So yeah, thanks for watching and uh, I'll tune in soon. Bye.